All right, hello everyone. It's been a while, I'm back. A lot has happened since my last video. Hey guys, and welcome to my shed. It's nearly been three years. I've turned 18, I've gotten my license, I've got a job, finished high school, I've become a photographer. But one of the biggest things that has happened since my last video, I will show you. I've become a Bee Swarm Simulator Discord moderator. How exciting. And if you are a part of the Bee Swarm Simulator Discord server, I know what it's like to deal with you, especially at this time when Bee Swarm Simulator's Beesmas update has been delayed by a few months. A lot of you have gone absolutely insane. And in some ways, I don't blame you. But sometimes, you know, you just have to be patient and let things happen. And a lot of you might be wondering, oh, when's Beesmas? When is this update being released? Why is Onnit so lazy? My internet nearly died. Well, it's coming. Just be patient. I've already said that. The day will come. And that day might be soon. I don't know the official release date. Everyone seems to think I do because I'm a moderator of the Discord community. That is not the case. The truth is, I don't know any more about this than you do. So don't pester me in the comments saying, Oh, you're hiding things. You actually know. Just tell us when it is. I don't know. If you're thinking about grilling me in the Bee Swarm Simulator Discord server, don't bother. I don't know a thing about this. I'm not hiding anything from you. What should I add to the stack here? Um, what do I need? What do I need? What do I need? Let's do the yellow left arrow sticker, because why not? There we go. Look, the only thing I can say about this update is what I might be able to predict. Seeing as the sticker update and trading just came out recently, I feel like the Beesmas update will have a fair bit to do with that. But I'm not sure how that's going to go for low level players, because they won't be able to get into the Hive Hub which is the trading server if you are new to this and don't know a thing. And seeing that it's been so long since everyone was expecting this update, I'm expecting quite a bit, but then again you can't be sure. Onnit has been pretty busy lately. He's recently been on holiday, he's been overseas, and he's had a mighty illness. Onnit has been through a lot lately and Seeing the state of the Discord server at this stage, with everyone grilling him up, I don't think it's giving him much more confidence in updating his game. So just try and stay positive, the update will come eventually. Even if I know nothing about it, I know you are going to love this update. There will be a lot of differences in this Beesmas update, as opposed to last year's, and I'm expecting the whole trading and stickers part to play a big role, as I said before. Then again, I don't know for sure. I just have to clarify that because I know a fair few of you will be thinking that I know about this update. I don't. I'm just taking a wild guess. That's a nice noise. Look, again, I don't know when it's coming but it's probably going to be soon. And honestly, I have big plans for it as well. I'm getting really close to getting the Planter of Plenty, which at this stage is the hardest item to obtain in the game. I've done the calculations. I'm like 96.2% there. So I'm really close. I've nearly got all the materials. I think I did use something earlier today, so that might have taken my percentage down a little bit. That's a big star. What I'm really struggling with for the ingredients for the planter of plenty are obviously turpentines. I need four more, 
and they are really difficult to get your hands on. Look, I can only make one of them because I need more star jellies. Look, you absolute idiot. Maybe if you didn't donate them all to the wind shrine in one of your last videos, then maybe you can craft some more. I can get more of those. But then in order to craft one of these, it takes away some of your caustic wax, which you need for the planter of plenty. And it also takes away some of your super smoothies, which you also need for the planter of plenty. So if you want to craft one of these, you lose some of your resources that you need. But during the Beezimus update, if it's anything like the last couple of years, it will be so much easier to get your hands on one of these bloody turpentines. If I remember correctly, the last Beezimus, I managed to get three or four turpentines. And I need four turpentines until I get this planner of plenty. So I'm a bit excited for that. I will get there and I will make it. It's going to be brilliant. But then again, I've got to be patient. And so do you. In the meantime though, just relax knowing that Honor has not given up on updating the game and the update will come. Sit tight and hold on. It's just around the corner. This concludes my little rant. Have a good day. I'll see you another time, whenever that will be. I hope to post more content over the next year. I don't want to give you another three year gap between videos, so I will try to make more content. My production value has gone up drastically. I've got a camera now. I've got different lenses if I need to use them. With that being said, please check out my Instagram. It's right here. I post most of my good photography on there. So be sure to check it out. Whether you're interested or not, I'm sure you'll find something that you like. Respect your community staff.